Okay guys, welcome back and let's check out this skit that popped up when we came up to sleep. Burr, it's totally too cold, c -c cold to sleep. Oh hey Captain, are you cold too? It is indeed chilly tonight, Pascal. Perhaps a drink is just what the doctor ordered. It'll warm you up and help you sleep. Oh, sounds great. Wait right there. What did you do before you started teaching at night school? Were you like a bartender or something? Perhaps. This looks totally yummy. Is it pot? Is, is she? Can she even drink alcohol? I bet she might be a big hit with the ladies. What makes you think that? You know, you're all dark and charming and mysterious or whatever. Ladies love mystery. Perhaps I should just have a pat. Perhaps I just have a past that isn't worth sharing. See, that's exactly what I'm talking about. <laughs> well, a lot alike, Captain. I was always making mistakes when I was young, too. That doesn't appear to have changed. Hmm, maybe not. Oh, hey, little bro. You can't sleep either. I'd offer you a drink, but you're still a child. <laughs> I'm merely too young to drink. I'm not a child. If you keep drinking like that, it will impair your performance tomorrow. Hick, what, what? Don't be shilly. Perhaps that's enough for tonight, Pascal. Gosh, it's getting pretty warm in here. I better take my clothes off before I melt. <laughs> Don't you dare. Eek, settle down, little bro. Why you gotta be all angry all the time? I <laughs> bored drunkards. And I might add that this is a terrible time to lose control of your <laughs> faculties. You have a point, but people can't operate at full stress all the time, Hubert. We all need to unwind. I disagree, Captain. People who think like that all often end up as failures. Failures, eh? Perhaps you're right. Hey, which one? <laughs> one of you clowners just made the room all spinny. I'm hungry. I wish I had pancakes. Oh yeah, pancakes with syrup and butter and bananas. Mm -hmm. Hey, what are you two looking at? Go to bed, both of you. We have an early morning tomorrow. Good night. <laughs> Pascal was drunk. She's a lightweight. She's a lightweight. She only had one sip. And she lost it. That was nice, though, to see that skit. You see that giant hole in the road? It's a crater from an explosion. Some new winder weapon, I bet. Alright, let's save. That was a cool little scene that you get if you had slept there. I'm still kind of pissed at that little kid taking my 1000 G, my, my freaking gall like that, like seriously? If you go through the mountain pass up there, you'll find a world entombed in snow. That The little kid didn't even give me a chance. Even though we could clearly run past him, we had to pay this asshole a thousand gold. Alright, come again. I participated in the invasion of Lot. We should kill your dumb ass then. You just submitted to freaking invading our hometown. What am I thinking? This is the wrong way. I guess we are not supposed to go that way. We should just kill that soldier, yo. He just said that he invaded Launt. So that's all the motivation I need to kill somebody. And then what are we supposed to do? That's strange. I, huh. I went to sleep right, so that should be enough I have to do. Hmm. What is she looking for? Ha, huh. wow, she's looking for money. That's how poor this town is. 
I don't understand. So what are we supposed to do? We just took a rest. We just seen the, the scene when she gets drunk. Apparently there was an area over here we couldn't see before. What are those kids looking for? Bits of Creus. Some are a little larger than a grain of sand. No kidding. What use is it if it's that small? They use it to heat their stoves. That's so sad. How goes the search? Not good. Our family runs the inn. So we need enough Creus for the guest rooms too. Oh wow. I see. Can't they just buy Creus fuel? This country has few Creus reserves, and they're mainly reserved for the upper class. The government has long turned a blind eye to this injustice. No matter how many people suffer. Wow, oh, Malik must have been here before. That's just how it is in Fendel. He must have been born in Fendel. In people have all the Creus they want. In Strata, we're not unfamiliar with Creus shortages ourselves. But this situation is extreme. This is Fendel? These poor people are our most hated enemies? I'm cold. Looks like you have a fever. You should go home and rest. I'll take care of the Creus. But we don't have enough. Don't worry. If I can't find more, I'll get a stratum horn. What? No, a stratum would kill you. Hey, I always figure something out. R right? I'm your big brother. Just leave it to me. So I'm gonna guess, take a hunch here. We're gonna have to go hunt down that Is strata something horn. something that a child should be taking on? No, it's not. They're extremely dangerous monsters that live on Creus fragments. The elith from the Creus accumulates in their horns. Uncountable men have perished trying to secure those horns. It's not a foe to be taken lightly. However, I think our party should be able to handle them without too much difficulty. Stratums are the big dog in the food chain, and the Creus in their horns is pretty rich. Okay. So even if we account for impurities and whatever, five horns should be enough. Okay, we'll take care of this. Wait, what? You should get out of this cold and find a place to warm up. Why don't you take her home? But... You're the big brother. It's your job to keep your sister safe. We'll bring you the horns in a bit, all right? Don't worry about it. Thank you. Thank you so much. We got this, bro. We Let's got go. this. Can you stand? All right. It's time to hunt some stratum. Yeah, okay. Now, guys, remember how to spell this because there was a password that we needed to do that. I'm going to actually write this down real quick. Stratum. S-T-R-A-H-T-E-M-E. -E. The reason why I'm taking that down is because we needed that name for a password for the chest here. Sharia acquired the kind-hearted title. So before we even take that guy on, let's go ahead and open that chest and see what's in there. That could be something very useful, or it could be something completely useless. So let's check it out. Alright, so I did write that down correctly. S T R A. Was it H T E M E? Book of Deduction. A spell that automatically deducts gall to if you refill your illness whenever you're in a town. Really? Well, actually, that that's actually helpful. So you don't actually, uh, so you don't actually have to keep going wherever you need to go so right now let me check the synopsis they didn't actually tell us where to go do we go through that cave all right what can we find the freaking stratum guy 
If we can't go through this cave, then it's most likely back there behind us. We're in the mountain pass as of now. Okay, let's do this. Pascal looks worried. She said she was torn between eating 10 banana pies or 12. Ah, this skit actually makes a lot of sense now. <laughs> now that I think about it. She finally learned that she loves bananas. Nice, a save point. And I think that's the beast we have to fight over there. Ah, nice, we found grapes. Alright, so guys, next video we'll fight the beast beast that terrorizes the town well not really terrorizes it's just a beast we're just gonna kill because we need you know to keep ourselves alive so anyway we'll return next video